but I, I think we could do a bit more for the way we we throw our rubbish away. Yeah, at the end of our road, there's um, McDonald's wrappers, and quite often um, friends of ours go out and pick them up. It's good that they've started they started the recycling process. I don't know how many years they've been doing that for now, but I mean, at least that's a start, isn't it? Mm. In the right direction. Yeah. But uh, whether we're doing enough, I don't know. The background uh, of the recycling company is um, it started pure and simple. We, were, we originally started as a contract cleaning business and we had issues trying to find uh, companies that would do the recycling. I mean, at the time we decided to do it, we had nobody on the island uh, actually shipping uh, cardboard off the island for recycling. Um, we predominantly had the odd company sending paper over to the UK, you know, like newspaper, um, but that was basically it. What, one example of, of items that we couldn't recycle better is the coat hanger. Right? Now, the manufacturer has this habit of putting a, a metal clip in it. Now, they already do a recycled coat hanger, but why put the metal in? Right? So, the manufacturing companies that do the plastic don't want this because of the metal, and the metal company doesn't want this because of the plastic. But if they just did that, then they would never solve the problem. But you hurt your hands by doing it. Yeah. So you know, you, if you, you know, if you can work a way around doing that, or actually getting the manufacturer that makes the coat hanger do it all in plastic or all in metal, one or the other. I mean, this is just one example of thinking about what you're throwing away. Since lockdown, we have predominantly gone on eBay and Amazon and got the nice pretty parcels. The problem is that the parcels also have filling and they're either uh, a polystyrene fill or they're um, a plastic bag inside or if they're really an environmental company, you know, it'll be a cardboard box and the filling is actually all shredded cardboard. Now that makes sense, uh, but when it comes to the you know disposing of it, it's oh well it gets all recycled. But again, when it comes into a recycling yard, if it's got plastic in it because the plastic hasn't been pulled out, it's a contaminant. You know, so it gets rejected. Uh, we've got to get over this rejection bit. You know, if if we can do that, we will have no problem with recycling. Recycling is actually easy to do. So it's tomorrow today.